In the scorching heat of 378 AD, Adrianople witnessed the unfolding tragedy of a clash between Roman Empire led by Emperor Valens and the strategic billions of Visigothic chieftain Fritigan. Despite commanding around 20,000 soldiers, Roman Emperor Valens found himself besieged by the Gothic envoys from Fritigan. The catastrophe began when against ordered mounted units on the right flank surged forward and engaged the Goths in unexpected skirmishes. Responding to months of anticipation, cavalry on the opposite flank rushed into a headlong clash with Fritigan's infantry on the hill. The Roman center, consisting of heavy infantry, eagerly joined the melee, initiating a chaotic battle while the Roman cavalry on the right faltered. Their counterparts on the opposite side managed to drive Gothic infantry into disarray. In the center, Roman legionaries faced off against fierce Turingi warriors led by Fritigan. As hours passed, Valens realized the consequences of Fritigan's diplomatic maneuvering. Thousands of Ruthenian and Allen cavalrymen arrived as reinforcement. This is the secret weapon that Fritigan was holding. The, res the reserve force of neighbor uh, neighbor tribes came in and helped Fritigan. As the Roman flanks crumbled under the overwhelming force, the remaining force found themselves isolated in center and circled by Goths. Despite the Gothic struggle against the well disciplined and heavy equipped Roman legionnaires, the battle raged on until evening. Aware of the dire situation, need for miracle violence witnessed the relentless onslaught. However, salvation never materialized. After eight hours of relentless